morning. Good morning. All right, guys, so go ahead and um, upper body, like I said, we'll need a variety of weights. So just get those ready. If you have your heavier weights, we're doing some um, chest exercises. So you'll want those. I'm gonna flip the screen back just a little bit. Um, but we're just gonna get started with our warm up exercises. So we'll take our feet nice and wide. We're just gonna squat it out. So sitting that chest up nice and tall back through those heels. <clears throat> Just starting to get everything all warmed up. Pretending just like we're at the gym. We'll go for five, four, three, two, and one. All right, so up next we'll have our reverse lunges. So facing this way, we'll lunge that right leg back, reach those arms up overhead. Tip that chest back just a little bit. Start to open up through that chest. And then right foot comes forward. We'll lunge that left leg back. Reach those arms up nice and high. Drop it down. Bring that left foot up. Lunge that right leg back. This time grab that left wrist. Tip it over to the side. Back to the center, bring that right leg up, left leg goes back. Tip it over toward the left side, grabbing at that right wrist. Back to the center, we'll take that right leg back. Place that left hand on that left thigh, right hand goes on that right hip, just gonna be a little twist right here. Right foot comes up. Left leg goes back, right hand goes on that right thigh. Give me a little twist with that left hand on that left hip. All right. We'll come back to the center. We're gonna go through some high knees. So get those knees up nice and high. Pull those shoulder blades back nice and soft on those toes. We'll go for five, four, three, two, and one. Take those feet nice and wide again. Hands go behind the head. We're gonna squat and cross now. Squat and cross. So you don't actually have to grab behind the head. Morning. We'll go for five. Four, three, two, and one. All right, now we're laying down on that mat. We're gonna flutter kick it out, but nice big flutter kicks. So lift those shoulder blades up, grab behind that left leg, stretch through that hamstring, drop it down, sit it up, grab behind that right hamstring, drop it down. We'll go five more on each side. Crunch it up, grab behind that leg. Drop it down. Crunch it up on this right side. Drop it down. Three more, give me that left side. Drop it down. Right side. Drop it down, give me two more. Really stretch behind that hamstring, maybe grab at that calf. Right leg. And one more on each side, left leg. And right leg. Hug those knees into that chest, maybe rock around on that mat just a little bit, opening up those hips, pressing that tailbone down to the mat, and then we'll work our way up. So I've decided that I'm gonna start making the most annoying things first so we can get them out of the way, okay? So this is gonna be a little bit of a plank series that we're starting with. We're gonna start with 10 inchworms, um, and then I'll walk you through what we're doing from there. So we'll forward fold, walk yourselves all the way out. With this inchworm, we're gonna do tricep push-ups. So we'll do one tricep push-up, walk all the way back to the feet. Staying forward folded, pushing through those heels, 
walk it back out. Give me that tricep push up. There's two. Walk it back. This time we stand it up. Forward fold, walk it out. Give me that tricep push up. There's three. Walk it back. So on these tricep push ups, keep those elbows tucked in close at your sides. Use those knees if you need them. Four. Walk it back. Drop it down. Five. Stand it up. Six. Give me four more. Forward fold. Walk it out. Seven. Walk it back. Stand it up. Three more. Walk it out. Eight. Walk it back. Two more. Walk it out. Nine. And we'll have one more. Walk it back. Stand it all the way up. Walk it out. Give me that tricep push up. So we're gonna stay down here. You're in a high plank position. Those wrists are gonna be just below your shoulders. You're gonna place that left hand into the center of the mat, walk that right to the right. And then the right hand takes over, walk it to the left. So it's just kind of like a little traveling high plank, okay? We're gonna do 10 on each side. So walk that right hand out, bring that right hand to the center, left hand comes out. Now let's bring that right hand over to meet that left hand and then take it back to the center. Take that left hand to the center, walk it over to the side. Keep that core nice and tight. There's two. Walk that left hand over, walk it back. So always meeting over to that outside hand. Three. Good. Four. Keep that core tight. Make it work for you. Five, we're halfway there, booties down, shoulders are relaxed. Six, four more. One, isolating that core. Two, three, give me one more. Walk it to the right. Now we're gonna find those forearms. We're gonna take it down to a plank. We're holding this plank for one minute. So draw that belly button up to your spine. Let's go for one minute. Squeezing everything nice and tight. Make sure you don't collapse down to those shoulders. Press those heels towards the back of the room for me. There's 15. 20 seconds to go. Squeeze those glutes a little bit harder. Press those heels back a little bit more for me. Last 15. Give me 10. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, now we're gonna go back up on our hands. So we're doing the slow knee drives. We're bringing them on the outside of those elbows. So we're bringing that right knee on the right side, left on the left. There's one. Right on the right, left on the left. Two, right on the right, left on the left. Three, good job. Four, six more, and then we're gonna go back to another plank. One, two, Three, get that knee up there. Four, two more. Five, last one. And six, good job. All right, so take it back down to a plank for me. Good, let's hold and squeeze. One minute right here. Press those heels back. Good. 
Just one round of this in case your little inquiring mind likes to know. We're 20 seconds in. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Stay with me, guys. Keep pushing. Halfway there. Reach that crown of the head forward. Don't let that chin fall into your chest. Press those heels back. Last 20 seconds. Give me 15. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Drop those knees down. All right, so up next, we have a side plank into side plank dip. So if you prefer, just stand up and do those standing side bends for the whole time that we do these with one dumbbell. Okay, so we're gonna use our right arm to start with. First, we start with a 30 second side plank and then we go into 30 side plank dips. 30 second side plank into 30 side plank dips. So lift those hips up nice and high. Let's hold it. So again, if you're modifying here, you're doing those standing side bends instead. Just grab one heavy dumbbell, drop it down. I didn't start. Sorry guys. This one's gonna be a little longer. I've already been told I can't count, so that's okay. 20 seconds to go. Lift those hips up super high for me. Last 15, we go straight into those 30 dips after this for 10. Five, four, three, two, and done. Give me those side plank dips. So down and up for one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, ten. Good job. Lift it up. One, using that body weight. Two, three, four, five. We're halfway there. One, two, three, four. Push it out. You can do it. Ten more for ten. Nine. Lift it up. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, let's switch it up. So our left arm takes over now. We're doing that same thing on that opposite side. So bring that left arm down, lift those hips up nice and high. Find that side plank. We'll hold for 30 seconds. I started the timer. Good, lift it up even a little higher, arch that side body. Give me 15 more seconds. We've got 10. For five, four, three, two, and done. All right, let's do those 30 side plank dips, down and up. There's five. Ten. That elbow should be just below your shoulder and your ear. Keep pushing. We're halfway there. Lift it up. Give me ten more. You got this. One. Two. Lift it up. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, and ten. All right, so now we're gonna find a one minute boat sit, and then this fun is over. So, boat sit is gonna be sitting in this position like this. Those heels are gonna be up. If you need to rest them and drop them down, you can. So, we'll hold for one minute. Try not to. Put your hands on those legs. Try to allow your core to do the work. Hollow that belly in. Roll those shoulder blades back into those back pockets. Lift that chest up nice and tall. Hands can be wherever is comfortable for you. Again, just try not to grab below the hamstrings because then you're taking the core out of the equation. Straighten those legs up as much as possible. 
We're halfway there. Keep pushing for me. Keep rolling those shoulder blades back. We've got 20 seconds to go. Keep that chest up nice and tall. Draw that belly button back to your spine. Give me 15. Last five, four, three, two, and done. All right, nice job. So just a little core burner to get started. From here, we're gonna have four sets of 10. We're doing hand release push-ups <clears throat> and one arm squat to presses, 10 on each side. So just getting that heart rate up in this beginning part and then we'll deal with more strength from there. So the hand release pushes. You're gonna start with your hands just below your shoulder, drop it all the way down, lift it up, push it up for me. We'll do 10 of those. And then standing up with one weight, you'll want like a medium to heavy dumbbell. You're gonna squat it down, press it up overhead. We'll go 10 on one side, 10 on the other side. We're gonna do four rounds of that. And then like I said, it gets a little bit more strength based after that, a little less heart rate. So let's go ahead and find that high plank position. Lower it down, lift it up for one, two. You can do a different variation of push-ups if you prefer, three, four. If you're using your knees, five, or a chair or a couch, six, just go until I'm done, seven, eight, nine, give me one more, and 10. All right, let's stand it up. We have that one dumbbell. We're gonna squat it down, press it up overhead for one, two. If you wanna take the squat out, just do that overhead press. Go until I'm done. Four, so use the time. Five, six, seven, eight. Make sure you have a nice challenging weight, nine. Not that anybody ate anything bad yesterday. 10, left side. No candy. One, two, three, four, five more. One, two, you got it, core is tight. Three, two more, four, last one. Five, good job. All right, weight goes down. We find that high plank position. We're going straight back into it, folks. Lower it down, give me those 10. Lift it up, push for one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, three more, eight, two more, nine, and 10. All right, let's stand it up, guys. We're back to those squat and presses. So if those weren't hard enough, let's go a little heavier this time. Squat it down, press it up for one, two, three, four, Five, good, halfway there. Don't lock that elbow or those knees. One, two, three, two more, four, last one. Good job, let's switch it up. Left arm, down and up for one, two. We'll have two more rounds after this. We're getting straight into a three, four, five, Six, four more, you got it. One, two, two more. Three, last one. And four, place that weight down. Give me that high plank position. Roll those shoulder blades back, reach that crown of the head forward, let's go. For 10, lift it up. Push, for one, two, Three, four, don't drop that chin to your chest. 
five, six, four more, one, two, two more, three, last one, and four. Good job. Stand it back up, grab the dumbbell. Again, if you need that heavier weight, grab it. Down and up, 10 on the right, lower and lift for one, two, three, four, push that belly button back, five, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, last one, 10, let's switch it up, left arm goes, keep going, for one, two, three, four, keep pushing, five, we're halfway there, five, four, three, two, give me one more, then we have one more round, one, all right, please that weight aside, give me that high plank position, Tuck those elbows in nice and tight. Let's do this for 10. Push it up. One. Two, keep that core strong. Mine's sagging a little bit. Three. Four. Five, five more. One. Two. Three, two more. Four, give me one more. Keep those elbows tucked. And five. All right, we have that weight one more time. Down and up. For one. Two. Three. Four. Five six, seven, eight, give me two more, nine, last one, 10, all right, let's switch it up, left arm, one, two, three, push it out, four, five, six, seven, eight, give me two more, nine, last one, and 10. All right, so up next we have three exercises in our series. That first one is gonna be just a regular bench press. So we're laying on the ground, bending those knees, pressing both those arms up at the same time, okay? Regular bench press. Second one, we're gonna lift our hips up nice and high into that bridge position. We're gonna do chest flies. So this time the palms face in towards one another, okay? And then after that, we're gonna flip it over. Each of those is gonna be 20. Each round, we're gonna do 10 plank to push up. So this whole plank theme is going this whole series. So alternating arms down, down, up, up. Use those knees if you need them. So we have four rounds of 20 of the first two exercises and 10 of the third exercise. So grab whatever weights you need. You want those nice heavy dumbbells for those bench presses. We'll roll it all the way back. Bend those knees, draw that belly button in, make that nice 90 degree angle. Let's press it up for one, two. Make sure you use a challenging weight. Three, arms should be shaking at the end of today, four. Five, mine are still shaking from whatever day, I don't know. Six, seven, eight, good job. Draw that belly button in. Nine, keep that back flat. Give me 10, keep those shoulders out of your ears. One, two, three, four, five, give me five more for five. Four, three, 
two and one. You might need a lighter weight for these flies. So the difference here is your palms face in towards one another. It's like a nice big hug. Lift those hips up nice and high. Squeeze those glutes. Give me those flies for one. Two, if you have a stability ball and you'd rather use that, you can. Three, but this is great for those hips, those glutes. Four, good, squeeze it up. Five, get those hips up a little bit higher for me. One, you got it. Two, keep it cranking. Three, you're just pressing back through those shoulders. Four, good job, guys. There's 10, we're halfway there for one. Two, keep squeezing those glutes. Three, give me seven more. One, two, last five, push it out for five, four, keep squeezing those glutes. Three, two, give me one more up and squeeze. One, good job. All right, lower those down, place them out in front of you, not back behind your shoulders. We're gonna flip it over. We have those plank to push us. So use those knees if you need them. Alternate arms each time. We'll start in that high plank, feet are wide. Lower it down for one, just 10. Two, three, four, five, halfway there. One, two, three, two more. Four, last one, left arm goes down and push it up. Good job. All right, so there's round one. We're rolling it back onto our back sides. We're back to that bench press. So if those weights weren't heavy enough, grab those heavier weights for me. Roll it all the way back. First one, booty is down. Draw that belly button, eliminate that space between that lower back and the mat. Let's go for 20, press it up. Palms, or uh, thumbs face in. Two, three, four, five, one. You got it, nice and slow. Two, three, four, ten. We're halfway there. One, two, Three, four, five. Give me five more. Push that belly button into that ground for five, four, three, two, and one. All right. Hips go up, palms face in towards one another. Let's do those flies. Squeeze those inner thighs together for one. Push it up. Two. Nice big hug, you got it. Three, four, five, squeeze it in. One, two, you got it. Lift those hips up higher. Three, feel those glutes work. Four, time, we're halfway there. Push it out. Squeeze those chest muscles for one, two, Give me eight more. Three, four. Good, we got five more. Relax those shoulders for five, four, three. Lift those hips up. Two. Give me one more up and squeeze. Good job. All right, weights go down. Come up to that seated position. Find that high plank for me. Let's do those plank to push ups. Take those feet nice and wide, lower down. Start on that right. Bring it up for one, two. Don't wiggle those hips. Keep them nice and level. Three, four, five, five more. One, two, three, two more. Four, last one on that left, and five. Good job. All right, we're two down, two to go. So roll it back. Draw that belly button in. 
thumb space in towards one another. Grab those weights for me and push it out for one, two, three, four. Don't lock those elbows up top. Five. Good job. Keep pushing. One. Fatigue is setting in. Two. Push through it for me. Three. Four. Ten. We're halfway there. Push it out. One. Two. Three. Four. Give me six more. Push that belly button in. Keep that back flat for one. Two. Three more. One. Two, last one, and three. All right, change that grip. Lift those hips up nice and high. Press through those shoulder blades. Fly it out for me for one. Squeeze those glutes. Press those inner thighs together. Two, three. Squeeze those chest muscles. Four, five. Six, you got it. Seven. Eight, good, nice job. Up and squeeze, nine. 10, lift those hips a little bit higher. We're halfway there for 10. Nine. Eight, push it out. Seven. Six. Five, lift them higher. Four, three, two, last one, up and squeeze, and one. Place those weights down out in front of you, not behind you. Make your way up to that seated position, and then we'll find that high plank. We have plank to push ups, and then one more round, and then we move on. So find that high plank, feet go nice and wide. Start with that right side, lower it down, hips are level for one, two. Use those knees if you need them, no shame there guys. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, last one, and 10. All right, so we have one more round of those bench presses. So if you have a set that's a little bit heavier, let's go ahead and push it out on this last set. Give me those heavier dumbbells. We'll roll it all the way back. Back is flat, press it up. Weight goes through those feet for one, two, push it out, three, four, five, good job. Keep pushing, one, two, I'm adding a little something at the end, three, so don't just move on, four, 10, give me 10 more on this last one, we'll hold those weights up for one, two, three, four, five, give me five more, five, four, Three, two, this last one, hold those weights up, hold and squeeze, like bend through those elbows. Give me 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, lower halfway for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, Five. We're still going straight into the next exercise. Four, three, two, press them all the way up. Palms come facing and lift those hips up nice and high. Let's fly it out guys for one. Lift those hips up, two, push it out, three, four, press back through those blades, five, Six, seven, you got it. 
eight, lift those hips a little bit higher, nine, 10, we're halfway there for 10, nine, lift it up, eight, keep pushing for me, seven, squeeze it in, six, five, this last one, we do that same hold for four, three, two, give me one more, let's hold up top, squeeze in, just hold those weights about three inches apart for 10, nine, eight, palms face in, booty is up, seven, six, five, four, three, two, lower halfway for 10, squeeze, nine, eight, seven, six, squeeze it, five, booties up, four, three, two, one, lower those weights down, those weights go aside for now, we're going to find that high plank position, we have those 10 plank to push up, so if you've been on your knees, let's try this last one on those toes, feet go wide, let's climb it out, for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, give me one more, and one. Great job, guys. All right, so up next, we have three different exercises. On these, we're just gonna go for 12 reps. So I will demonstrate them for you. You're gonna stand up. You're making that 90 degree angle. Squeeze those elbows in, press it up overhead. Squeeze those elbows in, press it up overhead. There's the first one. Second one, you're going front with that left, lateral with that right, and then alternating. So we're really counting out 24 here. Last exercise after this is gonna be burpees so I don't need to demonstrate that. So if you have a different cardio thing you'd rather do than the burpees, do that. If you need to grab a chair, a bench, something like that to make them a little bit less impact, then go ahead and do that. So go ahead and grab those dumbbells, whatever you need. Find that 90 degree angle. Squeeze those elbows in. Press it up for one. We're going for 12. Core is tight. Two. Squeeze it out. Three. Keep pushing. Four, you got it. Five, six, give me six more. One, squeeze it in. Two, slight bend in those knees. Three to go. One, two, last one. Three, all right, weights go down at the sides. Like I said, we'll start with that left going forward, right going lateral and then switch it up. So I'll count every other one. So up and out, there's one. Up and out, two. Good, make sure you're isolating that muscle, not using momentum, three. Four. Five. Six, we're halfway there, push it out. One. Keep it going. Two, soft bend in those elbows. Three, three more. One, relax that neck and shoulders. Don't let them take the brunt of this move. Two, last one. And three. All right, we'll head into those burpees. So again, if you need that modifier, go ahead and grab whatever it is you need. Let's go down. You got it for 12. 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, give me 6 more, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 
Give me one more. And one. All right. Stand it back up. Grab those dumbbells. Make that nice 90 degree angle for me. Squeeze those elbows in. Lift it up overhead for one. Squeeze. Two. Squeeze. Three. Squeeze. Four. Good. Squeeze. Five. Push it out. You're halfway there. Six more. One. Two. Three more. One. Two. Last one. Three. All right, lower those arms for just a second. Roll those shoulder blades back a couple times. We'll start with that left forward right out to the side and then switch it up. So bend those knees just slightly. Tuck that tailbone back for me. There's one. Two, again, use that muscle, not that momentum. Three, fight that burn. Four, keep it going. Five. Six, we're halfway there. Keep it going, you got it. One. Two. Three, three more. One. Two, last one. And three, good job. All right, weights go down. We're back to those burpees. Let's do it. We got 12 for 12. Our rate gets back up, 11. 10, add that jump, add that push up, whatever you want, nine. Eight. Seven. Six, halfway there. Five. Four. Three. Two. Give me one more. One. Good job, stand it up. Doing good, guys. We're back to those fly to presses. So grab those dumbbells. Give me that 90 degree angle. Bend those knees just slightly, squeeze it in and press for 12, 11, 10. Don't let those elbows drop, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, we have those front and laterals. So forward with the left, lateral with the right. Roll those shoulder blades back just one time for me. Let's go. For one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Good, you got it. One. Two, three, four, five, last one, and six. All right, we head back to our burpees. Then we just have one more round of those, and we'll move to our last set of exercises. Let's go for one, two, Three, four, keep that heart rate up, five, six, six more, one, two, three more, one, two, last one, and three. 
All right, so last set, folks. You got this. Make that 90 degree angle. Up and squeeze. Bend those knees just slightly. Up and squeeze for one, two. Burn it out. Three. Core is tight. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Last one. And twelve. Good job. All right. Front and laterals. Left goes front, right goes lateral. Switch it up for one, two, three, four. You got it. Five, six, seven. Keep it going. Eight, nine, three more, one, two, last one, and three. All right, last set of burpees, guys. And then we'll need those heavy dumbbells again. Let's do it for one. Make these your best ones, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, four more. One, two, three, last one, and four. All right, so. We're gonna need our heavy dumbbells. We're gonna be back on the mat on our backs, okay? So, palm is facing in. We're just gonna press up. One, two, back down at normal speed. One, two, back down at normal speed. One, two, back down at normal speed, okay? So we're gonna do 15 of those on each side. After that, we're doing a pullover. So bringing that weight back up overhead, holding it lengthwise, and then switch it up. Then we'll go over to that left side, palms face in, one, two, back down normal. One, two, back down normal, okay? From there, we'll go to sit up to press up. On the last one of those, we'll do 15 of those. We're gonna do 10 just incline presses up, okay? So I'll walk you through all of that. I know it sounds like a lot of information. So roll it all the way back. Make sure you have a nice challenging dumbbell here for me, okay? So press it up for a two count. Palms face in, one, two, lower down. One, two, lower down. One, two, lower down. One, two, that's four, keep pushing. One, two, five. One, two, six, you got it. One, two, seven. One, two, eight. One, two, nine. Give me six more. One, two, one. One, two, two. One, two, three more. Press it up. One, two, one. One, two, two. Last one. One, two, three. Hold that weight lengthwise. Start it right at your thighs. Pull it up and over, bring it back to those sides for one, two, make sure it's a hard enough weight guys, three, four, keep pushing that belly button in, five, six, seven, slight bend in those elbows, eight, squeeze that back, Nine, give me six more for one, two, three, three more, one, two, 
Last one. Three, weight goes into that left arm, palm faces in. One, two, back down, one. One, two, back down, two. One, two, three, you got it. One, two, four. One, two, five. One, two, six, keep it going. Elbow stays tucked. One, two, seven. One, two, eight, this should be hard. Heavy weight, one, two, nine. One, two, ten. Give me five more. One, two, one. One, two, two. You got it. One, two, three. Give me two more. One, two, one. Last one. One, two, done. Weight goes at that chest. Knees are bent or legs are straight. Sit it up and press it up for one. Give me ten. Two. That last one, we stay up and we press for 10. Three at that incline. Four. Five. Six. Seven, give me three more. One. Two, last one. Three, keep it up, press from that chest up. One, just like you're doing an incline press. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, three more. One, two, three, let's roll it back. We're back to that right arm. Press it up for two. One, two, back down. One, two, back down. One, two, there's three, one, two, give me four, good, one, two, five, one, two, six, good control, one, two, seven, again, if this is not hard, one, two, eight, your weight is not heavy enough, one, two, nine, give me six more, one, two, one, one, two, two, one, two, three more, one, two, one, one, two, two, last one, one, two, three. Hold that weight lengthwise, put it at those thighs, press that belly button and give me those pullovers. Up and back to those thighs for one, two. Keep pushing that belly in, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, press that belly in, 10, five more, one, soften through those elbows, two, three, two more, four, last one, and five, all right, grab it in that left hand, palms face in, one, two, bring it down, one, two, bring it down, you got it, one, two, there's three, one, two, four, one, two, five, one, two, six, good, keep it going, one, two, seven, push it out for me, one, two, eight, one, two, nine, Six more, one, two, one, one, two, two, four more, one, two, one, one, two, two more, one, two, one, last one, one, two, done. Weight goes at that chest. We're gonna sit it up to press up for 10. Sit up, press up for 10, nine, eight, Seven, you got it. Six, five, four, three, two. Stay up, straighten that back, lean it back just slightly, chest it up for ten. Nine, eight, seven. Incline press, six, five, four, use that core, three, 
two, one. Good, roll it back. We're back to that right arm, guys. Tuck it in, you got this. Press it up, one, two, back down. One, two, back down. One, two, back down. One, two, back down. Good, keep it going. One, two, there's five. One, two. One, two, seven, good. One, two, eight. One, two, nine. One, two, ten. Give me five more. One, two, one. One, two, two. One, two, three. Two more. One, two, one. One, two, two. Weight goes lengthwise. Bring it down towards that belly and that waistline. Pull it up and over. Good. For one, press that belly button in. Two. Three, four, keep pushing that belly button in. Five, one, two, three. Really reach over that head. Four, ten, give me five more for one. Two, three, two more, four, last one, and five, palm faces in, press it up, one, two, one, one, two, two, one, two, three, you should be thinking about how this is maybe going to fall on your head because it's getting so hard, five, good, press it out, one, two, one, one, Two, two, one, two, three. You got it. One, two, four. One, two, five. Give me five more. One, two, one. One, two, two. You got this. One, two, three. Give me two more. One, two, one. Last one. One, two, two. All right. Sit up, press up for 10. Press it up for one. Two, three, four. This last incline, we're going for a full minute. And then we'll be all done. Five, six. These short and sweet workouts are so hard to get used to. Seven, eight. Give me two more. Nine, last one. 10. All right, find that incline position for me. We're going to press it out for one minute. Let's go. Roll those shoulder blades back. Burn it out, guys. Chest is up nice and tall. Give me that incline press. We're 10 seconds in. Keep pushing for me. Twenty in. Relax those shoulders. Press it straight out from that chest. Make sure that back is nice and strong. We're halfway there. Keep pushing for me. You got it. Don't quit on me. Give me 20 to go. Last 15. Keep pushing. We got 10. Five, four, three, two, give me one more and done. Great job. All right, guys, you did it. So we're just gonna stretch out really fast. So I want you guys to find that child's pose on the mat. We're gonna reach those arms out in front of us. So our feet go together, our knees go out to the side, reach those fingertips forward, sit it back into that child's pose. So tomorrow is going to be a total body workout. We're going to work on a lot of compound moves, some fun ones, a little bit of balance, but it'll be a good workout. All right, so let's bend, bring those hands together in prayer position, bend those elbows, bring those thumbs back to that base of your neck. So scoot those elbows a little bit further, feel that stretch through those triceps.
Release those hands out. Take that right arm, sink it beneath that left arm. Bring that right ear down to the mat. Stretch through that right shoulder. Right arm reaches back forward, left arm snakes beneath that right arm, left ear comes down to the mat. And left arm comes forward, walk those hands all the way back, roll those shoulder blades back just a few times for me. And then give yourself a nice little round of applause. Great job today, guys. Make sure you get outside. It's supposed to be nice. I think this is the last day for a while. So get outside, do something active, walk, run, bike, whatever you can. Have a great day, guys. Thanks so much. Bye, Elizabeth. Thanks. Bye.